Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Nisar Gagadam and today we are going to go ahead and look at how can we extract specific details from different type of invoices using machine learning extractor. Yes. Now in today's video, we are going to go ahead and use UiPath's AI fabric component, which is invoices. Now, right here in front of me, as you can see, I have a couple of invoices downloaded in one of the folder of AI fabric invoices. Now I will open the first invoice. Now this is a sample invoice, so there's no company name. I am I have made sure I'm not using any company's data, so uh, no issues. However, we have the invoice number, we have the date, and we have also the some of the details which we are going to extract. Now, if you look at this format, the format is completely different. Here, the invoice number is right here, invoice date is here, and the total amount is right here. It's not in the table. Now the third format is again a different format where invoice number is displayed here, invoice date is displayed here, and then the total amount is displayed right here. So all the three formats are different. Now I have a PDF document where again the format is different where the invoice number, date of issue is written right here, and the total amount is written right here. Now how are we going to make sure, and again these are the multiple formats and different types of invoices, okay. So how are you going to make sure that we extract similar details from the different formats of invoices, okay, without training multiple types of uh, training instances. So in that, for that, we are going to go ahead and let's execute the bot and let's look at how can we get the accuracy. So I'm just going to say run. Now, once I say run, it's going to go ahead and pick up the first data from my folder of data. Now here, if you look at the three images, one of the images is a PNG and two images are JPEG, okay? Now let's expand the document a bit. And if you look at the invoice number, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, which is extracted accurately, as you can see on screen. Invoice date, which is 13, 5, 2011, which is also accurately captured, 100% accuracy. 971.56, this is also exactly accurate. I'll say save. Now the first invoice has been captured very accurately where I have captured invoice number, invoice date, and the total number, total amount. Now, this is the next document. The format is different. However, the same field invoice number has been accurately captured with the 90% of accuracy, but I, I would say it's 100% accurate. So I'll just go with pass. Invoice date is 2nd of November, 2019, which is again correct. So 100% accurate, uh, which is again pass. And then the total amount where it says 97%, however, it's 154.46, which is again 100% accurate details. As you see, the document format changed. However, the similar fields we are going, we are able to extract with 100% accuracy both the time. Now let's look at the third document, which is going to get processed. So this is the third document. Now you see, we have designed a mechanism which is going through each and every invoice, no matter what the format of the invoice is and no matter what the uh, you know, extension of the invoice type. I mean, it's an image, it's a PNG, JPG, or it's a PDF document. And no matter what the format of the image layout is. So you don't need to follow a specific template for that. Isn't this wonderful? Now let's click on invoice number. You see 1827, then you click on invoice date, which is again 22nd November, 2013, which is again accurate. And then total amount, which is 87.10. Again, 100% accuracy. Now let's click save. And it will now navigate to the PDF uh, you know, invoice. So the images invoices are done. And now it will navigate and it will extract the details from the PDF invoice. As you can see on screen, the invoice number is again 100% accurate, which is 9988665, which is exactly accurate. Let's look at the date, which is 5-5-2015, which is also perfect. And the total amount is 12540, which is again correct data. So we are getting all the data as 100% accurate. Let's look at the remaining three data. Now, if you need to achieve this robot, if you have a similar task, you need to extract the similar fields out of invoices, but you have different formats of invoices and that you need to perform using UiPath, then you, need, you must learn this complete series. Uh, in the next video, I'm going to tell you how exactly are you going to create this bot. So as you can see, the invoice number again is correct, the invoice date and the invoice total value, which is again exactly correct, being the different format of the PDF. As you can see, from earlier PDF, this is a different format. It's, it's like from Facebook, Facebooks, right? What is it? Yeah, Facebooks. It sounded something like Facebook. Okay, 
Now only two PDFs are remaining, which are again of a different format type. So we have seven documents and till now, till fifth document, we have captured 100% accuracy. Now how is that possible? If you go ahead and look at this, this is again correct. This is again also correct. 30, 10, 2019. Yep, this is correct. And then the total amount is 8,000. So again, 100% accurate. And now the last PDF. So if you look at this extraction, the extraction till the time is 100% accurate, no matter what the different format of invoices that you're picking up. It's still identifying exactly the invoice number, where invoice number is placed, where invoice date of issue. If you look at this, the invoice number, invoice date, which is again accurate. And then there's a total amount, which is 19,000. So we have 100% accurate data. Now let's go ahead and refresh. And if you navigate to invoices, you get all the data extracted right here of all the seven documents that you have captured. Isn't this wonderful? If you navigate to simple fields, you'll get all the data. Now this is the formatted data. We don't need that. So we will follow this data, which is exactly accurate where we have all the invoice number and invoice date. I will need a couple of uh, string operations to remove these brackets here, but that's okay. However, the data extraction is 100% accurate. <clears throat> and for that, we have not trained multiple extraction models. We have used only one single machine learning extractor model. And we have trained AI fabric component for that. Now let's look at how we can achieve this using combination of AI fabric document understanding and UiPath Studio. So let's look at how can we create this entire bot in our next video. Thank you so much for watching this video. Happy automation. See you soon in the next video. Click on the link right below.